Okay, uh, we're doing the area of a circular sector here. We did the length before, now we're going to do the area. So basically what we're trying to do here is, and I gave you the same exact example. We use the formula A equals one-half radius squared times a radian measure. Now, this is in degrees, so we have to turn it to a radian measure. I've got this circle here. It's got a radius of four centimeters, and it opens up 45 degrees. When I'm finding the area, when I'm basically doing what I'm basically doing, what I am doing is I'm finding, you know, this little piece of the pie, the American dream, as it were. You know, how much does that take up? So that's my attempt at humor. A equals one half. Uh, the radius is four centimeters. When I do that, it's four centimeters times four centimeters. It's four squared. And then it's times uh, the radian measure. It's 45 degrees. That's the same thing as pi over 4 in terms of radians. I wouldn't leave your answer in terms of pi. I know some teachers don't mind it, but that's just me. Area equals 1 half. 4 squared is 16. You can put 16 over 1 if that's going to help you. Times pi over 4. So I've got 1 times 16 times pi is 16 pi. 2 times 1 times 4 is 8. That's equal to 2 pi. That's roughly 6.28. So area equals 6.28 centimeters. And we're working with area, so it's always square. So that's the formula for the area of a circular sector. Hopefully that was helpful. Well, it was quite brief. Have a good day for now. Goodbye.